This is one of the most insane mice that I've ever seen, and I'm not saying that lightly. This is the Ragnarok 2, a vertical gaming mouse that is meant to look and feel like a real gun, featuring real life grip ratio compared to a normal gun, triggers, the whole works. This thing is absolutely insane. So let's go ahead and take a look at what this thing looks like. So we can see in the box, we get the actual Ragnarok 2, the mouse mechanism itself. You get this little base, which gives you a little bit more stability when you're actually using the mouse. You also get a USB-C charging cable, which is nice to see, which conveniently plugs in right in the front. Can't forget about our little friend, the mouse dongle, and that wraps it up. So it's clearly meant to be used in FPS games where it gives you that real life trigger. And I think it's gonna be really a unique gaming experience. I've tried it out a little bit before this and it was pretty gnarly. Let's go over the different buttons and the different triggers that this thing features. Let's start with the left side of the Ragnarok 2 first. This little tiny black button, this is what they call the fire button. Now when I tested it before, I didn't even realize it was there. And the next one we have is this silver scroll wheel. This is what they call mouse click 3, but it's just a scrolling wheel that has a nice little texture on it. On the front of the Ragnarok 2, we have two different triggers. The top one is designated to left click, and the bottom trigger is designated to right click. It has some real nice haptic feedback. When you pull either the triggers in game, they actually vibrate and it, it makes it feel really realistic. If you'd like to turn that feature off, it has a vibrator on or <laughs> off button uh, to simply turn off the vibration. On the right side is just a nice textured grip. There's actually no buttons there. And on the top, we have a DPI button. And I believe it says that this is 16,000 DPI. The optical sensor on the mouse is the PixArt PAW 3335. So the Ragnarok 2 does come with its own software, which allows you to change and configure up the different buttons and switches, uh, left click, right click, middle click, stuff like that. I found it pretty funny when I downloaded the software. It's just called wireless gaming mouse, except mouse is spelt wrong. But it does have advanced settings as well, where you can mess with DPI, set up macros and all that cool stuff. But I think it's time. We're gonna be testing out three different games. Apex Legends, Halo Infinite, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. First up, Modern Warfare 2. Yeah, it's kind of nasty. Even at long range, it's really not that that difficult. All right, this thing is sick. I'm getting warmed up on it now. Let's hop into some Halo Infinite. All right, now this might be a little more difficult with the Ragnarok V2, seeing as that it's a controller game and I'm gonna be playing keyboard and mouse, but uh, we're gonna be trying the best here. <laughs> It is so hard with a mouse input to get a kill on Halo Infinite, so let's hop into Apex and then we'll do a final review on the Ragnarok 2. I, I, I like the vibration a lot, the haptic feedback is super nice. We're on the flank, we're on the flank, we're on the flank. All right, final thoughts on the Ragnarok 2. I think the ratio, uh, where how it fits in my hand is just perfect where the triggers are. It's really well thought out. I like the different buttons on it, the vibration, uh, the grip on the side, the, the, the stabilization base as well. It does have some pretty nice skates on the bottom. It, it moved around really fluidly. I think it was a really cool and unique mouse experience. Would this replace my mouse and how would I perform head to head? I would have to play something like Aim Labs to figure that out, but I don't think it's a stretch to say that if you picked this up and started using it on the daily, that you could get used to it and probably compete with a normal mouse. I don't think we have to strictly label it as a gimmick. Super, super unique. So definitely one of the coolest mice I've ever used. If you wanna try it out yourself, I will link it down in the description. Thanks for checking out this video. Stay tuned for the next one. Join the Discord as well. We got a giveaway coming up. We're giving away a kit of DDR5. We'll see you in the next one.